Hey, welcome back to another bus building video. Um, as you can see, I'm sitting by my kitchenette here and I'm sitting in my passenger seats. These are the two main exciting parts that were finished um, over the course of this past like week, week and a half. So without further ado, let's hop right into the video and yeah, see what me and Dave got done this week. All right, so we are putting in the kitchen area. Got the uh, countertop up here and the drawers here. What I'm doing right now is marking the line where the sink is gonna be. And I'm gonna cut this out and then the sink's gonna sit down in there. And that's where we're at right now. Um, as you can see, we have the floor pretty much installed here. And we're able to put the kitchen on top of that and then the sofa is going to go back on top of that. That's where we're at right now. Went ahead and cut out the uh, hole for the kitchen sink here. My blade's a little dull, that's why it's burnt in the corners. But <laughs> we're going to go test fit it now and uh, check it out. Hi and welcome back to the channel. <laughs> so we got our hole cut in the uh, countertop and gonna help go ahead and dry fit this in here. Got the sink here. Hopefully this fits. Moment of truth. Boosh. Well, there it is. It's supposed to come all the way to the front, I think. And then uh, that way we then. can get the sink, the, uh, the faucet in there. Wow! That's so exciting! So we're just gonna go. Now we're gonna do the same thing out of the countertop. I can't see. Nice, my glasses. That's about an inch and a quarter, about an inch and an eighth. Front to back, this is good. I mean, it's in. Yeah, it's just got a little bit of that room, and but... We'll try to... We'll put some Didn't go crazy and I just stopped before all that wood pulled together really hard. Maybe push down on this corner now. like a lot of counter space actually. I feel yeah. like I wasn't thinking it'd be that much once the sink was in. Cool. It's all good. Pretty good. We just glob some caulk in here. Seal that up in there. Put that going into your tank here. And you just scoot it on out. Let's see if that'll fit in there on that end. sealed right but it's right enough for what we're doing that's right and now we'll just throw this on here this, uh, is that a gasket that there's a gasket hey i know something hey here from the inside and now I'm gonna drill woo, <laughs> a bigger one to put the fill spout into to fill the water tank and yeah let's do it like put these headphones on here you want to take that take this okay put these on safety first 
What? Here, I'll take this spout. Okay. When do I stop? I'll tell you when to stop. Hold well, it? yeah, hang on to it and uh, just don't try to go full send pushing on it. Just get a little at a time. There you go. Yeah, you got to hang on to it. So like I say, just take a little at a time. Yeah, brace yourself. Oh my God, this is intense. Yeah, so hang on to it. Hold on, back up, back up. Back off and get it going. Yeah, just back the drill out, get it going. There you go. I mean, don't just don't try to jam the whole thing at once. Get it started. There you go. It, it'll get going. They keep going. Yeah. There you go. One. This was my grandpa's. This was made in America. These are old tools back when they were made well. half inch grade 8 bolts going through here holding down the uh, passenger seat vans underneath right now cranking them down and we have uh, three quarter inch locking nuts with washers down there now to hold it nice and tight okay what we got here is the passenger seat <coughs> in order to use it all you gotta do is pull up on that yellow hook Put, it, put the seat down, then you sit down, then you go ahead and take that uh, crazy looking uh, strap, put it over there, grab the other end, buckle yourself in, throw your armrests down, you are ready to travel. All right, pretend, good. pretend there's a huge crash, man. Wow. You're held in place. Oh, yeah. Ouch. Well, that's going to be some hip damage. And maybe some whiplash, but you are in there. <laughs> maybe a broken neck. <laughs> <laughs> we are putting a heater pad together. Okay, let's continue. We have the heat source, the cotton adhesive thing, and piece of sticky aluminum. We have the stick this to this, right? No. This, then this, then this. Okay, well this has a sticky thing too. Yeah, it'll stick to this. Okay, go ahead. We don't know if this is right. So... Don't scold us. Don't scold us. It was wrong. wrong. It was I mean, wrong. Look, it looks to me metal plate, foil, cotton pad. So... We're doing it right, right? Stupid right? destructions. I just feel like it's wrong to have the metal, hot metal plate exposed. I know. I don't know. Well, we'll know when the bus burns down. We've made a huge mistake, I think. So we're changing our plan. It's like the tank's bowed in, so it's not. <laughs> it's not. Are you getting it in on the side? Yeah. Oh, 
Yeah. It's not sticking because the paint is like suck. It's like vacuumed from the from the pump, like sucking the air out. It's like it's, it's like low. it's yeah, indented, it's so it won't. You fixed it. I don't know. I'm pretty positive. The instructions made no sense, and we're just kind of sending it. You're Gucci, Tori. You're Gucci. All right, let's plug it in. Yeah. And see what happens. We plugged in the heater, and now we're gonna see if it's warm. The water tank. The water. Here. It's not freezing. <laughs> <laughs> Well, you didn't say warm, so. Yeah. It'll probably take a while for yeah, it to get. Yeah, I mean, that's like how, I feel like that's just how it is just sitting in here. I don't it, think. Yeah, it's not cold. How's that working? And is the pump pulling from the bottom of the tank? Yes. It's draining into the uh, little gray tank there. Beautiful. Amazing! Well, that was our last bus building video. Uh, at least in terms of the building of the bus, I think we are finished. It is livable. I could move into it as at any time really at this point and it's ready to go. So that's great because Dave and my mom and my brothers are moving to Georgia in a few days. So we met our goal. There are still some smaller things that need to be done. Um, but nothing that's essential, really, to the operation of this bus. So um, I'll be keeping you guys updated on that sort of thing. And I'll also still be like decorating it and making it more of like my home. So the next video is gonna be kind of just about my first night in the bus, which I have not had yet. I haven't had my first night yet. I'll be moving in in about a week. Um, it's gonna be about, you know, how has been living in it and decorating it and all that sort of things kind of born to like the lifestyle side of the bus life as opposed to the building of the bus and um, yeah that's kind of it let's see I wanted to show you guys my bed situation I don't know if you really got a good view of it here is the bed it is very high and I will admit now I am big enough to admit that I maybe should have not made it so high. <laughs> it is nice though, there's lots of storage space, but it's kind of even hard for me to get in and I'm fairly tall. So I'm going to leave you guys with a nice little laugh here of me getting in here. Well, I guess that wasn't so bad, I'm getting a little bit better at it. But yeah, please come back next week and I'll have some more decorating videos of getting the bus like homey and cozy and cute my favorite part but yeah it's just gonna be me from now on no more Dave he's probably gonna be our last Dave video so let's let him leave you with a nice little farewell at least farewell for now it's not like I'm ever gonna see him again I'm going to visit them soon but <laughs> farewell for now from Dave Okay, that's a wrap. That's it for me. Uh, it's been a blast working on the bus. We are pretty much done with it. Tori's about 98%, maybe just a couple little things, but that'll be it for me and the videos going forward. I've had a blast working on the bus and it's been awesome. And be sure to subscribe to Tori's channel and follow her and her adventures. And make sure you like and comment and and all that. <laughs> so thanks. <laughs> <laughs>